Um, well, I was nominated um, for Blue Jacket of the Quarter, uh, second quarter. Um, I won that. So uh, I guess that automatically puts you in for an input for the Blue Jacket of the Year. Uh, from Fairfield, Illinois. A uh, small town in Illinois, about two and a half hours away from St. Louis. Uh, joined the Navy May of 2010. You know, I, I'm the guy that, that they go to during a GQ to operate the Slick 32, which is the ship's uh, anti-ship missile defense system. So, uh, you know, I'm that guy that protects the ship from missile threats. So that's something that I also take pride in. Um, winning, winning Blue Jacket of the Year was definitely um, the, a high point in my career so far. It was something that I was definitely setting a goal towards that I wanted to, that I wanted to accomplish and wanted to win. And I definitely have my uh, chain of command to thank for that, for being there to support me, to have my back, and to push me towards it. Um, it's definitely something that I appreciate, um, and it definitely means a lot to me to be to have won this, and it's you know something that that I definitely take to heart, and that I will represent you know will represent the Carl Vinson very well. We put him in charge of things that that are really. Uh, trusted upon us to be to be responsible for. He's he's in charge of a really a multi-million dollar system. One thing a seaman Scott knows is when he takes on the JTT system for he took on maintenance. Um, so full of complicated yeah. checks. We got the blinkers program for band three yeah. um, he's taking his checks, absorbs it, and he just he grit he gets it. He grips it very well. Beginning of the maintenance period, uh, a lot of us were T A D to different, you know, rehab teams. Um, right now, a lot of it is like space preservation and maintenance um, it's, and, it's, and getting the, the equipment and the systems back and up, up and operational. Um, since he's made Blue Jack of the Year, he's, he's stepped up. He continues to step up. Um, I'm quite frankly, I'm proud of him and what he's striving to accomplish and his excellence. He, take care of, he takes care of junior sailors. He goes very hard with sailorizing, training. Honestly, working with Pastor Scott's been a, a privilege. Um, it's great to see junior sailors that you see come and report in, and they they try hard. They put in great hard work, and they excel. They do great. It, it's honestly it's a pleasure to work with them. I just want to thank everybody that has that has pushed me. You know, has has been there for me to. You know, to support me, to just just give me that sense of guidance. You know, that has gotten me this far. I, I definitely just, you know, I want to say thank you. You know, I, I take it to heart. I definitely appreciate it.